New tonight, Monday marks 22 years since the 9-11 attacks. Today, first responders gathered in Greenville ahead of the anniversary to honor those who made the ultimate sacrifice. Our Scarlett Liz Jack was at the event and spoke to those who attended. Hundreds gathered here at Floor Field today to honor the first responders that gave their lives on 9-11. September 11, 2001, a fateful day burned into our nation's memory. That day uh, on 9-11, 2001, uh, many brave people went in, gave their lives, and they didn't come back out of the World Trade Center. The attacks in New York were felt across the country and still linger today, 22 years later. We say 343 firefighters, firefighters are still dying today because the cancers developed while they were working on the pile that day. So it's an ongoing issue. To honor the memory of those who ran towards danger, Greenville City Fire Department hosted a symbolic event to pay their respects. Climb the equivalent of 110 stories, which is what the World Trade Center was. And it's just a good way for the community to come together. We have crossfitters, we have military, we have the first responder element, we have families, we have uh, families climbing with their children, with their spouses. We had firefighters from Irmo, from down at the beach area, uh, Bluffton. We also had retired firefighters from New Jersey, as far away as New Jersey, to come down here and climb with their families. To raise money for an important cause. From the entry fees to the sponsor fees, all that goes to the National Fallen Firefighters Association. So firefighters who were killed in the line of duty, this money goes back to them to help their families, education, and things like that. And that's what, what, that's what it's about. Also, to teach those growing up in a post-9-11 world what it means to never forget. It allows us to remember. Um, a lot of kids growing up today, it's a piece of history. They weren't alive at that point. By doing events like this, seeing hundreds and hundreds of people, hundreds of firefighters, hundreds of law enforcement, it's a way to bring that imagery to life so that they can now join in the memorial and their remembrance as well. The Greenville City Fire Department tell me that this year is their biggest turnout for the event yet in Greenville. Littlest Jack, 7 News. And we're told Greenville ranked sixth in the nation last year for the climb by raising nearly $60,000 worth of donations. This year, event organizers believe they surpassed that number. A heads up for Greenville drivers.